Hi, I'm Luke. And I'm Danielle. And together, we're, we're Pacific, Pacific Trek. Trek, a couple passionate about travel and living life to the full. In 2019, we moved from our home in Jensen Beach, Florida, to Australia. Along the way, we went on a cruise to the Bahamas. And an epic road trip across the US from Miami to Los Angeles. We visited so many awesome places. From the Georgia Aquarium in Atlanta, and to the French Quarter in New Orleans. All the way to the Grand Canyon and sunset over Santa Monica. We want to take you along for the ride. to go on a tour of it. Mm -hmm. um, we pay 30 bucks to go on a tour and um, they take us through the power plant and the dam, but you can do a cheaper tour. Yeah, so it's one hour. Um, you can just do the dam tour or you can do a self-guided tour. So the dam tour is 15 feet and the self-guided is 10. So we decided to do the hour, the bigger one for 30 bucks. So you can see the um, inside of the Yeah. yeah. Oh, the electricity is cool. Yeah. But yeah, this is the, that's the Hoover Dam, big dam. And there's a really cool bridge over there. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah. yeah this is Nevada time and Arizona time. Because right there is at, um, Arizona. Oh, wow. Uh -huh. And right here is Nevada. That's so cool. the state lines are right in the middle. You, we're only about, what, 40 minutes from Las Vegas? Yeah, so it's not a bad day trip. Minutes, yeah. yeah. So that's a good place to come and visit. After our tour had finished, we went for a walk across the top of the dam wall. This used to be US Highway 93 before they built the bridge. What was your highlight of the tour? Uh, I really liked the, the dam tour part. The power plant was interesting. The dam tour, like going into the tunnels. Yeah. It's pretty interesting. And just the genius of it all. Like, I think it was really well thought out. 
and like I like the execution. I feel like this is a well-oiled machine. Great tour, great value. I'd pay 30 bucks again to do it. Yeah. It looks like you can park over there for free, but we're not 100% sure if that's okay. Uh, we should look up tips to see if that's true. Yeah. That's the visitor center over there now. Can't really park over there. We're gonna head back across. Beautiful Colorado River. Here's a fun fact. I always thought that the Hoover Dam was named after J. Edgar Hoover, who started the FBI, I think, but it was actually named after President Herbert Hoover, who was the president at the time that the wall was built in 1929. I probably should fix my hair before we start recording. Great sound quality here. Yeah. We're just walking across the Memorial Bridge. Beautiful. It's not an old bridge, it's pretty new. Because it used to be that to cross from Arizona to Nevada, you would go across the Hoover Dam. And they built this bridge so that you could go, you could actually walk across it. There's the Hoover Dam down there. And this bridge is really tall. Pretty scary. Let's see over here. Whoa. After a day of exploring the Hoover Dam, we went out for a steak in downtown Las Vegas at Hugo's Cellar. There they make the salad right in front of you and the steak is absolutely amazing and every lady gets a rose. If you're in Vegas, I definitely recommend stopping in for a great meal. Where are we visiting from? So we are from Florida. We've lived in Florida for the last, or I've lived in Florida for the last four years. We're moving to Australia.
After dinner we checked out some more of the downtown area of Las Vegas. Often this is known as Old Town Las Vegas. Very different to the strip that you commonly think of. We'll be covering more of Las Vegas in our upcoming videos so make sure you click the subscribe button and follow along for more of our adventures coming out in the next couple of weeks.